I just generated this chart using my SQL data. I didn't have to write any SQL queries. My AI agent did. Let's do it together now. So this is the code to do it, which I did in less than 70 lines of code. Um, uh, it's using True AI and Compose tool set. Um, so as you can see, I'm initializing, importing a bunch of libraries, then there's a task to kind of get the input from the user. You can query anything from your data and print charts or get the data. Uh, so I'm initializing an SQL agent, which will do the SQL queries and a code interpreter agent, which on top of data can do some analysis using Python code or even print some good visualization. And then forming it all as part of a single crew, uh, which like combines the powers of the power of SQL and Python to create interesting visualization. Let's see it in action. Firstly, let me show you the data. So this is basically uh, the name of the employees, their email IDs, and uh, their salaries. So let's see what our AI can do with this. So, yeah. Let's get the bar chart representing average salaries of employees by their first name, uh, first letter of their name, which means Michael and Michelle will be part of the same group. Let's see it in action. So the crew started. It is using Compose Use SQL tool to figure out how the data looked like. Now making the query and it did the right query to get the first letter and the average salary corresponding to it. Now it would need the code interpreter agent. That's the interesting part. So compose you. We are very, very we value security very heavily. So kind of every code is run in a separate sandbox, um, and uh, so that like there is no effect on your local environment. Okay, so it generated the chart, but it's in the sandbox now. It needs to get it on my local machine, which it will do using the get file command. It's here. Ah. So it, the chart is generated. Awesome. 